you're gonna see Wilde now. Now she's gonna like, where's the shit? Where's the chicken shit? I like to eat the chicken shit. <laughs> yeah, boy. Molly seems to be ready. Wilde seems to be ready too. Although she has a quite weird position. I mean, what the hell? Are you doing yoga on the sofa? You're not supposed to be there, you see? <laughs> Clumsy ass dog. So it's time for a walk. And as I said last video, I showed you guys how it looked around the yard. And let's just say the least that <laughs> a lot of things that ha has happened. So we're gonna take a tour around the house. If you're wondering like, Philip, why the hell aren't you uploading videos? We want to see what Molly's up to. We want to see how lazy Wilde is and Molly's obedience training. You know, have you done any? I'm kidding. No one cares. But at least I can entertain you guys with some videos. Come on, dogs. Okay, there's the pit. Molly! This is what we've been doing. <laughs> like, Wilde, stanna. Saturday which is two days ago, I spent at least 14 hours digging this pit. Of course, with a machine that is over there, I don't think you can see it because of the sun, but we've been digging and putting a cable. I'm gonna show you more, but you know, <laughs> the whole backyard is destroyed. It's a lot of work living on a... Can you say that this is a farm? I would like to say that this is a farm, the farm life with dogs. And in the future, we're gonna have horses, chicken, maybe some goats. This YouTube channel is gonna be busy, to say the least. But right now, I have to find the time to edit. That's the hard part. To film, I mean, I enjoy go out filming, talking to the camera, uh, pretending that I'm talking to you guys at the moment. But you're gonna see this in a few hours. And of course, I'm taking the dogs for a walk as well. Where the hell is Molly? Molly! <laughs> Tuk tiché! Make sure to don't crush my car with that stick. And as you see, I removed a lot of grass here as well. Uh, I remember that I filmed this part, so I'm gonna try to film on the same angle as I did before. Maybe I can find some angle and do it in slow motion. So we can see the difference. As you can tell, I'm quite proud of the work I've been doing for the last week. One thing that do our dogs love, I'm gonna make sure they don't, they aren't there. Yeah, uh, we are <laughs> planting raspberries. We have 50 raspberry plants that's gonna, well, they're gonna give berries uh, next year, but we gave nutrients to the raspberry plants, which is, I think it's like chicken poo, or maybe not chicken, you know, the adult chicken, I don't know the English word for it. But anyway, basically it's their shit. <laughs> That is the nutrients for these plants and our nasty dogs, they like to eat that shit. You're gonna see Wilde now, now she's gonna like, where's the shit? Where's the chicken shit? I like to eat the chicken shit. There's the machine. So what we've basically been doing is we're putting a, a different heat system and I can try to explain it. And if I explain it good in English, then I'm gonna use it on the channel. If not, I'm just gonna remove this part. So basically, before they have direct electricity to the house, which is very expensive. So we figured we're gonna put a, a machine or a, whatever the, f the name is, is on the back or is in on the other side of the house. That machine is uh, connected into two cables, and those cables are 500 meters long, half a kilometer, and they are connected to the other side, I mean, under the house. So I've been digging here, putting the cables there because the idea is it's one meter deep and you know, it can be minus 35 Celsius here, but one meter deep is probably plus four or five degrees. You know, it doesn't freeze below, I think it's like 70 centimeters or something like that. So we have basically some liquid in the, the tubes and the tubes will be maybe four or five degrees Celsius when it comes 
all the way here and go into the system. Then the system is gonna take the heat from the liquid and push it back. So it's four or five Celsius when it comes into the machine and when it leaves the machine, it's gonna be minus four or five Celsius. So it basically takes 10 degrees. Then it pushes the liquid back and the liquid goes under the, you know, in the pit and the warmth from the pit one meter deep is going to heat it back up to four or five degrees and then it's just going to go around and around and give our house heat. <laughs> I don't think that I explained that pretty well but this is what we'll be doing. Wait the camera okay now I change the camera so right there where I'm pointing we have covered the tube with some well some mud or dirt and why we did that you know it takes a lot of time hey 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 will the bot god damn it okay duktig tjej here you can run okay so we've been covering those tubes for 500 meters like 24 hours hard work on two days and uh, you know, it's because when the, this machine over here, that I'm quite embarrassed that I don't know the English word for it and I'm too lazy to Google it, but when the machine drops heavy stones like that, that some weighs over 100 kilos, if it drops right on the tube, it's gonna destroy the tubes. We basically covered it with a lot of dirt, so it gonna takes a lot of, a lot from the, you know, the pressure from the stone, so it's gonna, hopefully save it because if we're gonna have to do this again I'm I'm not gonna say the word even but yeah this is what we've been doing it feels weird having your whole backyard destroyed and by the way guys if you don't like me making vlogs about, you know, what I'm doing on my spare time when I'm like, I'm doing a lot of things. YouTube is like 1% of everything that I'm doing. But if you don't like to know what I'm doing, like things like this, if you're not completely not in interested in what I'm doing, you can type down a comment because I want to make videos that you guys are interested in, you know, that I can actually either entertain you or make informative videos so you actually learn something so it's either entertainment or educational who is the fastest between the staffy and the am staff the staffy got a long lead but the staffy will win the staffy will win look the shave in the hey <laughs> here comes molly is she crazy yeah she's a bit crazy that that little lady yep but of course, digging this pit and making the heat system is not enough for us. Hey, 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 build it. Come. <laughs> that is not enough for us. Of course, we got to remove this tree as well that is leaning. That's a lot of hard work, but it gave us a lot of wood. I'm going to show you soon. <laughs> yeah, boy. Oh, that's a big stone. Yeah, it's a big stone. Yeah, it's a big stone. Yeah, it's a But anyway, this is why all this stuff is here. 
And here we got some more wood. I don't know if you see it. But of course, doing all this is not enough. Of course, we gotta have more work. Molly! Los! Come eat! Come eat! <laughs> I told her to drop the stick. She don't really want to do that, but come. Let's go inside. Wilde is old. I'm going to make a video, by the way, about the difference between these breeds. Uh, it's such a big difference. And people are calling both of these dogs as pit bulls. And they couldn't be further from the truth. I mean, how can you have the same name of two totally different characteristics on the breed standard and it's it's just weird but i'm gonna make a video more about like our daily life how i exercise molly how i exercise wilde over here uh, the difference between these two breeds i mean if you have patience with me and make sure to comment what you'd like to see i noticed that there is a lot of people like they started to comment like what you would like to see next and i really appreciate that and i'm gonna do what you ask me too. But anyway, as you saw, we have a lot of work that we've been doing and it takes a lot of time and it's time for me to start editing the videos. But I'm going to show you one more thing that we're doing, which takes a lot of time. But before I do that, I can just show you the difference. As you see, Wilde is sitting here calmly getting petted, like feeling, feeling life, enjoying life, being calm. That is what my ADHD dog is doing. And there's nothing wrong having ADHD. I'm just saying that, no, actually she don't have ADHD. She has H, 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 H. And if you don't know, H stands for hyper in ADHD. And she has hyper, 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 hyper diagonals. All right. Molly, los, hit. Hit. Come in. Yeah, go in. <laughs> As you see, Wilde is immediately going to the couch. Immediately going there, laying there like, okay, I did what you asked me to. I went out, I pooed, I peed, let me sleep. And if you want, you can pet me. Molly's like, more, more, give me more. Let's go. <laughs> All right, you gotta stay there. Molly, nah, nu räcker det. That's enough. So we have another room that we're doing. We're gonna renovate the entire freaking house. But as I said, we have one more room and we're gonna renovate the entire freaking house, but we're gonna take one room at a time and of course the backyard. So we just removed the old heating system where we put woods, you know, to make a fire which was heating the, the elements. And we're gonna paint this floor like tomorrow. And me and Felicia have been doing this room because there was holes all away, all around the, the place. So we're gonna remove the lamp. We're gonna remove the contact over there and this stuff over there. And we're gonna make a gym. So hopefully soon you will see the difference I'm gonna give myself some mater material right now and then I can make a before and after video. <laughs> Not that maybe you guys care, but I'm gonna save it for myself. And that's one thing that is great about YouTube. I spend all this time filming, talking, editing, making it, in my opinion, a decent editing, but then I, that, that stuff gets saved for 10, 20, 30, 50 years, I don't know, till I die. And when I'm 80 years old, I can go back to my YouTube channel and reminisce of like, yeah, I remember that. I remember Molly. I remember Wilde. I remember the first time we moved into the house and the time we spent, how much energy we had. I'm 80 years old now, so I, I can barely walk. So if you stay this long in the video, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And uh, make sure to write down a comment what you would like to see, if you have any questions, 
what you would like me to do for the next type of video. I have my plans. I have so much material that I'm going to edit. I have really cool videos. I mean, really cool videos when I'm skiing with Molly on the mountain. And it's just so much. But make sure to write down a comment and I will be sure to reply to that. All right, stay positive. Peace. <laughs>